Hey guys, it's Titan, and welcome to Civilization 6. Now, this came out, I think it's been about a month now, about a month ago. Um, and I played one practice round, and I started the second one. But I decided I was going to start recording instead. Um, so here we are with Germany. So they got additional military policy slots. So if you don't know, okay, let's start off. If you don't know what Civ is, it's a um, turn-based strategy game built on hexagonal, hexagonal tiles and you have, there's multiple different ways you can win. Um, I'm, well, I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm still very inexperienced at this version, um, but uh, I get extra combat strength against city-states, which I'm probably not going to use. An additional military policy slot, which can be very useful. Um, and I can build one more district than usual in all my cities. I also get a special um, production district and the U-boat, so let's get started. Oh, my bike jungle. Yay. <laughs> uh, move one away and then. Let's see. I was going to slide away then. Alright, let's go over here. I think it's a desert. Yep. Inspiration. Having discovered another continent, we realize there's a wide world of trading opportunities. Hold up, hold up. So, yeah. This continent is Novo Pangea. This is over here, Zealandia. <laughs> That's a wonderful name. We'll scout, start out well. Uh, I guess I'll build a, no, a little monument. So yeah, I played one practice round of this, and I've not done anything since really. Uh, so to start out, I think mining is where we're gonna go because of this. Um, stone right here. Uh, so it's a large map with eight players instead of ten, because I always like having a little extra room around just because. Uh, so this is gonna be interesting. It's a, it's much more complex than the last one. We got our um, civic and our research going. Oh dear, that's that's fun. Uh, which are two different ways of like researching things, so to say. Uh, but yeah, let's not go close to them. How about? Let's go right here. It's foxes. I moved one. I think I should be able to get them now. I can get the foxes, the tobacco, um, the cows. I should be able to get them all within my three tile thing. There's more cows. Let's move him here. Might want to attack this barbarian scout. Might be beneficial to me. I don't know. He's moving. Okay, we're good. Horses, more tobacco. Hmm. This is not as nice of a setup as I would have liked. Um. Started inland. So pier. Pretty far inland. But yeah, let's uh, keep exploring here. Oh, copper. Ivory. I might have to put a city down here. Eventually. Research complete. Who deserves more credit than the wife of the coal miner? Mm, yeah. Alright, we got that done now. This is really a lot different than... There's like not social policies, so to say, like in Civ 5. Uh, it's very different. Animal husbandry. It's very different uh, than Civ 5. Which I like. It's a very interesting game. Oh. Okay, Stockholm. Construct an encampment. I'm um, probably good. So you got Stockholm. Sweden. City state, because Sweden doesn't get their own country like in Civ 5. <laughs> they probably will in one of the DLC, but yeah. They already they pumped out a builder. Keep exploring. Let's see. Oh, I gotta choose a production. Let's make a scout now. We got that extra culture per turn that helps our civic go faster. Old gear moves. All right, next turn. <coughs> All right. Oh, what's up? Just next turn. 
mountains. Okay, I'm gonna go around these. Stockholm is gonna get an early start here. Ooh, that's what we need. Change policy. All right, so I mean, that's all I can really do. One plus production or one gold and one. Fa I'm gonna do that one. It's kind of similar. Just of five, but there's very much different things. Let's do four and trade. Hmm. Animal husbandry is complete. Hold off. How much is a um, builder to buy? Oh, we don't have that kind of gold. Alright, what are we researching here? I mean, we got probably pottery. Yeah, let's do pottery. <laughs> also planning on building a worker after the scout is done. More oh, great. And a barbarian. Encampment. Tribal village. Oh, that's like the, um... What's it called? It's basically the equivalent of ancient ruins. It's tribal village. Okay. Your progress for the mysticism has advanced considerably. Nice. Uh, let's not do that. She's a production. A builder. Why is it taking so much longer now? How is there a horseman already? I don't understand. Alright. There he goes, that's good. Ooh, civic complete. I'm gonna keep my things like this, I think. I'm liking how that's looking. More foxes, okay. Hmm. Can't believe somebody's already got already gotten that jeez. <coughs> hmm. I want the um hang gardens. Let's see. Hmm. Mysticism. This game is very strategic and it's it can go so many different ways depending on how you play. I'm actually surprised I haven't met anyone yet. Did I get like a content alone or something? That'd be nice. It happened to me once I played against my brother and um I was Gandhi, which was a huge advantage for me because <laughs> he got extra growth in Civ Five. I was playing, and what happened was I spawned on a, or I started out on a island all alone, inland, and as I did a little exploring, I realized I was on an island alone, and I started to grow like a maniac, and despite having way more cities than Gandhi should ever have, ooh, candy, <laughs> despite having way more cities than Gandhi should have ever had, and my population was absolutely massive, and he tried to sneak attack me, but I was prepared. I had my entire continent with coastal cities all around it, and he didn't stand a chance. I crushed him like a bug. The fool. Ooh, Brussels. Brussels massive. Your contact with other states is crystallize your ideas of governing your own people. Your progress towards political philosophy has advanced considerably. This is good. Your candy's been getting to work. What does Brussels want? Triggering inspiration from military tradition. Huh. Cross. Man, I haven't found anybody yet. This is crazy. 
least I have room to expand at least. I hope. This is like somebody like right around the corner here. Holy crap. Oh, where I need to put a city. Con builder. Waiting for you. Civic complete. My liege, we have an envoy at our disposal. Ooh. We can use the envoy to gain favor with this. Oh, we don't have any wild card policies right now. Chiefdom. I probably want olig oligarchy. Yes, I can talk. Yeah. Well, so I'll probably end up wanting. Man, this place is so much. Hello, Yervin. All right, what are we saying? Early Empire. What does this one get? Open borders, colonization, land surveyors, craftsmanship. I'm gonna do. Send envoy. Stockholm. I'm doing Stockholm. I'm on for Stockholm, man. Mm. Alright, we got him back. He's just gonna defend the city. For scout's job to explore. What did I find? I'm in a city state right here. Oh, this is a camp. Yay. Geneva, alright. That's another problem I would have with this um, Civ 6 is a city state uh, system. Because, um, old city state system, you could get like every city state if you're making enough money. Uh, now you have to pick and choose, really. Irrigation. Eureka. Alright, let's see. I want to do... Probably writing. That's probably important. Hanging gardens. Oh, it takes so long. <laughs> Not doing that yet. Alright, take out this barbarian. Shouldn't be too hard. Oh, here we go. I also kind of like the graphics in this. It's pretty cool. Warrior was attacked by a new warrior. Good job. Gonna kill him pretty quick. Um. Build a farm there, and I'm gonna do the cattle too. Okay, I found the coast. That's really good. Right by a river too. Ooh. Problem is this for encampment. There's whales here. That could be very useful. Man, there's so many resources in here. Look at that. Oh, here we go. It's probably dead. Yep, I killed it. Poop, 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 poop. Nope. Oh dear. Please don't lose him. Please don't lose my worker. <coughs> yeah, I don't think they're going to attack it. Okay, good. Yeah, he can't do anything. That's weird. All right. K 
keep moving, keep exploring. I haven't found anybody, man. Could be like a big mountain range here, and then there's on the other side of it. Or they could be dead. <laughs> I don't think they're dead. Probably not dead. Hopefully. I do not know. <laughs> okay, let's get this uh, pasture going. Oh. What did I get? Two gold for all trade routes. Let me see. Three turns that'll benefit me. Yep, okay, it's gonna drop me one gold for now, but it will help me out later. Hmm. The Empire. Mm, what happened? I heard a noise. Oh well. I think that's all for that turn. Two turns until we get our trader. Our trade. Not a trader. Or he, a caravan. A traitor. A trader, not a traitor. You know? Yeah. Oh man, there's so much land I can expand into here. Stupid. Brussels, huh? I'm liking Brussels. Oh yeah. Your knowledge of currency has advanced considerably. This is good. Granary. I don't think I'm going to end up focusing on a religion in this game. Pantheon might be nice. I don't know. Writing in two turns. I'm just sitting there. Silk, ooh, and the <laughs> snow silk. Uh, Stockholm. All right, we have recently gained advanced knowledge in city planning. Creating districts in our cities can be much more powerful and lucrative than simple improvements like farms and mines. Hmm. Okay. Ooh. Crater Lake. Never again can I gaze upon the beauty spots of the earth and enjoy them as being the finest thing I've ever seen. Crater Lake is above them all. Ooh. Discovering your natural wonders inspired your people with the majesty of the universe. Your knowledge of astronomy has advanced considerably. Ooh. Tribe. I need to get to that. Astrology, probably. What I'm gonna do here? Holy side. Great. Hello, barbarian. What are you doing? Let's run this way. Dang it. I knew that was gonna happen too. Come on, don't die, don't die, don't die. Run, Stockholm, help me. <laughs> There's the ocean on this side. Dude, I might be, like, alone. <laughs> okay. Cory looks awesome. <laughs> I don't believe in astrology. I'm a Sagittarius. 
Wow, Astral XP has been completed. Oh no, he's chasing me. Now he can move faster. Hmm. New currency. Get some money going. Oh, Pantheon. Um. I want faster border growth. I looked at everything else, and it's not. Nah, I don't like them very much. So I'm gonna do religious settlements. Aha. Uh -huh. There we go. Got a road being formed there. He attacks me as the disadvantage twice. He's got the river and the I'm on the hill. Oh, he's attacking. Oh yeah, go Stockholm. Oh, really? Jerk. <laughs> Short him. Alright, let's see what we can make. Stonehenge, huh? It's like a hard decision here. Increases growth by 15%. <sighs> Do a, this one. Let's do a campus right there. Furs right there. Oh, oh, oh ho ho! Hello, sir. You are new. Um, let me come. Exp let me come meet you. How about? What's up with you? Great, as soon as I leave. See? That's what happens. Nobody shows me any respect. <laughs> I, s I wanna meet these guys. I'm assuming it's... Per... No. Spain. Dang it, they plunder they mm -hmm. Let's make get a builder here. Gonna buy him. Okay. I wanna meet this guy. Come on. If you got the wine. He's gonna get tons of horses. Oh man, Spain, come on. I'm coming for you, jerk. <laughs> Hi, you're stuck. I'm just gonna leave you. interesting all right well i think we're about to meet hit spain in the next episode so thank you guys for watching it may have been a little bit um different boring i don't know <laughs> we'll see uh thank you guys for watching i'll see you guys in the next episode of whatever we do Bye bye